Okay, so now that we solve this problem, another problem that we can have is extra background. So let me show you with one of the movies from Levi 2. Uh, okay, so I'm going to open this movie. And how to solve this problem. So here, if you see, he already have we remove all the background super easy and however here there is extra background we don't we need to remove this region we need to remove the scale bar we need to remove that and how we do that so we have to label here and we have to use ctrl c and ctrl b why because uh, it's easier sometimes removing manually something is much easier before that the green stuff so for example here this would have been very difficult to remove manually it will be it will have take a long time however these things are much easier to remove manually so let's try to do it together so first thing that you have to do is um, you just go here as I said go to this and here you just click 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 uh, click if you want you can just surround this region and now it's closed if you see there are white white squares and here you have a yellow one so this is closed now I can go and pick a black color so Control C and now I copy this black region here very easy why because that is background that we don't need that we are not going to measure that the software made a mistake or uh, or is too just uh, is too um, it's very difficult to with the settings and if we remove more more of the settings we move them uh, we will actually make our life more difficult so this one was an easier way to remove it to do what the software was not able to do then you can go to the next one control b control b uh, yeah let me see so excellent if you see here i control b i forgot one section and um, here i forgot the section and look then i go here control v and this is the background of the pupil case that uh, is too bright so uh, it was it's too fluorescent it, there's too is the floor is too fluorescent yes it's, it's uh, the fluorescence is too high and and it's very difficult to read and uh, remove so look now it's gone here we have one small problem and we remove it in in less than a minute so it, it was easier in this way now let's go and see now let's going to remove this section of the uh, of of the bottom and if you see here we could have done this just have a square and added in all these pictures but we will lose this data what we can do is go here and again use the rectangle and um, mm -hmm. and go around it yeah. because it's the only if you see the rest of the dots they are not there and here you can go just control C the black of another region and just paste it there very easy it's like using a photoshop or using paint and now i press just ctrl b because i copy the color and i just move and i press every time i press ctrl b ctrl b ctrl b and i keep removing every every region then i can press with the mouse and each time that i go to the next slide Press Ctrl B, Ctrl B, Ctrl B, Ctrl B, Ctrl B. All the time. I can go one more time. 
Mm, there shouldn't be anything. Okay. So yeah, and look, in this way I was able to remove all the background manually that I that I had. That it was it, it took me one minute, and you have to go and check for mistakes. And for example, this thing I have to remove it, and I will have to make sure. Sometimes this is why it's a good idea to save all the process as I show you here. Uh, that I did with uh, Sonia's movie. Mm -hmm. and why? Because sometimes, for example, here I forgot to delete this point, this section, and I don't want to repeat all of those ones yet. Yeah? So uh, if I save, but I save each one of these steps, I will not have to go back all the all of this. Although it, it doesn't take sometimes too long. Okay, so let's close this. You can save it, but if it was a real example, we will save that. Okay, so 